Hello and welcome to the Clinical Liver Disease video series. Um, CLD is an official digital learning publication of the ASLD. I am Juan Jose Gonzalez. I'm a second year gastroenterology fellow at the University of Florida and the author of uh, Muscle Cramps and Cirrhosis. There are significant clinical and research efforts um, on the management of complications of cirrhosis, including ascites and hepatic encephalopathy among others. However, physical and psychological symptoms like muscle cramps are frequently overlooked. Keeping that in mind, uh, we took this opportunity to highlight some important points. Number one, muscle cramps affects more than two out of three patients with cirrhosis, interfering with sleep, limiting mobility, and contributing to poor health-related quality of life. The pathophysiology of muscle cramps is um, in cirrhosis is likely multifactorial. You can refer to figure one on our paper when you can find all the proposed mechanisms and how current treatments target these mechanisms. When it comes to uh, effective treatment for muscle cramps in patients with cirrhosis, uh, this remain very limited. Um, the therapy should focus on three things. One, prevention. Two, decrease the frequency, and three, decrease the duration of muscle cramps. When it comes to uh, frequency of muscle cramps, medications that have been um, studied include L-carnitine, branched-chain amino acids, sinks, uh, and muscle relaxants, among others. The problem uh, with these studies uh, is that uh, there's small sample size, non-randomized designs, single central recruitment, and lack of long-term follow-up safety data. When it comes to duration of muscle cramps, uh, there's a recent uh, randomized control trial that showed that in 69% of patients who received pickle juice, uh, muscle cramps were aborted compared to uh, placebo. These are great news. However, also it showed that there was no improvement on sleep or in health-related quality of life. Then when we talk about prevention, uh, there's a, the RELAX trial that has just been uh, completed and that will uh, let us know what the role of nocturnal stretching and meditation is in the prevention of muscle cramps in cirrhosis. It's very important and we cannot emphasize enough the importance of a routine assessment of physical and psychological symptoms in patients with cirrhosis since this can lead to an early identification and intervention of untreated symptoms, ultimately improving the health-related quality of life of these patients. On behalf of all of us uh, on the CLD team, I hope you found this review of muscle cramps in cirrhosis useful. For more information about the management of patients with cirrhosis, please visit us at www.cldlearning.com. Thank you for watching.